Welcome to PCA 2024, brought to you by... So, <laughs> this is the Cigar Smokers Hot Rod Capital of the World right here. And so what we thought we would do, I haven't told Ed yet, but what we thought we would do is see who could smoke one of the brand new flathead resonators fastest. Right? No. 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 <laughs> it's too good <laughs> to smoke forever, fast. I'll be man. Yeah, that joker's a beast. I've, I enjoyed it. We, we just got some and they were fantastic. Right. But I'm, I'm a fan of the CAO line. And so if you could share some of the greatness... Yeah. That'd be fantastic. Well, I appreciate you guys being here. Um, I'm Ed with CAO. Uh, welcome to PCA 2024. Um, I am a brand manager for CAO. We have something new this year called CAO FASA. We have two extensions within FASA. It's called Noche and Soul. Um, the Soul is the orange uh, branding on that. It's got a Honduran Osa wrapper, Cameroon binder, Nicaraguan Dominican filler. You come over to Noche, the FASA Noche has a Connecticut broadleaf wrapper and then the Cameroon binder Nicaraguan Dominican fillers uh, so I wanted to sort of come with no BS sizes you know based on what we're hearing in the market the surveys that we see so instead of choking a retailer with multiple sizes I'm just bringing them two sizes the Toro and the Gigante so keep it real simple for them right um, all the stores what they'll tell you is that hey listen you know thank you for all the sizes but what, what really works for me is the Toro and the Gigante so let's not waste any time right so uh, we've got two sizes, the 650 Toro and the 660 Agante. The price points are a little different. Uh, the price point for the Toro is 699 SRP. Uh, the price point for the Agante is 799 SRP. So in this world where we're seeing prices rise, I need to sort of bring it back down to earth. Um, so really approachable price point for anybody. Um, another thing that I'm really proud of is I am somewhat infatuated with box designs and mm -hmm. efficiencies for retail stores. So the simple idea that I had with this box is that we have two routes on the back. So instead of the retailer, you know, taking my lid and ripping it off, throwing it in the trash, I give them the opportunity to sort of use this box creatively as a function. So this one will fit in. And now all of a sudden you have a kickstand Fantastic. when it's on the shelf, right? They're going to do it anyway. I'm just saving them the time. So everything's right oriented. You have this built-in shelf talker that has a spot for the price, the QR for the story, strength, wrapper binder, filler, and then some tasty notes for consumers if they're if they're smoking cigars in the store and somebody can't be there uh, to tell them a little bit, bit about it. All that information is there for them to do. 24 count boxes, medium body blends. You know this blend isn't really made uh, to scare anybody away with the spice or the pepper or anything like that. Just really good flavorful medium bodied cigars uh perfect for you know any time of the day night or day so that's hence the the noche and the soul fantastic you know, fossa is a word that means phases so you know basically it's a representation of you know the phases that we all go to when we discover the hobby of cigars you know you come in you start to learn and then you learn more then you you know next phase phase two phase three you know all the way to you know become somewhat of an expert um so this really is a culmination of everything that I've heard from my sales reps in the retailer community, cigar smokers, and I tried to just to cram it into this, right? So great price points, uh, great sizes, great blend, great box for the retail store. I don't think you can get any better than this. Well, I know the construction is going to be on point, and I know the blend is going to be great. Yes, sir. But to complete the whole picture with the, with the boxing, but that banding has got me, my ADD is just going off the chain. It's got that cutout on the yep. top. And there's a notch at the at the foot band that actually could slide up, yes, to, and it, and that's that's just putting the finishing touches on it. You know, it's just uh, that yeah. active detail. I agree, and you know, it's weird, but I wanted the tobacco to be part of the art. I wanted the wood to be a part of the art. So this cutout that you're referring to allows the wrapper to come through, allows the wood to come through. So everything is just a part of this project, right? So I, I'm really really proud. You know, the way the blend came out, the way the box came out, you know, the reception that we're getting. Um, I couldn't be more prouder of this 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 brand of CO Fossa than I am right now. So thank you guys for listening. Um, it's shipping in a couple of weeks, so I'm looking forward to everybody's feedback.